This is the hardest escape room in Rust. It has 10 different rooms, each with their own puzzles. And if I can't complete them in time, this is what happens. A big thanks to Mr. Digi for making this entire thing just for me. His server details are down in the description, but more on that later. It's time to escape. I'm awake. Oh no, this looks familiar. Oh no, I'm in a jail cell again. Oh my God. Okay, I gotta be quick. I don't know if there's a timer. I don't know if I'm gonna die. I don't know what's going on. Okay, we have a number, uh, nine, seven. Okay, is there anything else in this room? There's a switch. Oh, we have a small box. Oh, I've got clothing I can put on. We have a cassette tape. It says Mimeo on it. Okay, I should probably play this, right? Hello, Mimeo. I want to play a game. Oh, God. Do you recognize the room you are currently in? It is from the first puzzle I trapped you in. Seems like you did not learn much from the experience. <laughs> you have even started making trap ACs to torture people. Oh, no. This must stop. To survive, you must simply leave through the exit. The path is rigged with many traps, or you can stay and die. The choice is yours. I gotta get out of here. Okay, so if I remember from like two years ago, I think I gotta break this thing, right? Can I even hit that? All right, let me get rid of this box first. I reckon I need to break this little uh, switch in the corner. All right, get rid of this. I really hope this is what I'm meant to do. It's broken. That did nothing. Oh God, maybe I don't know what I'm doing. Is there anything out there? Nine, seven. Okay, maybe I need to enter that somewhere. Wait, hang on. Oh, what is that up there? There's a box. I see a box in the corner. Can I reach that? Oh my God. We got a key. Done. <laughs> ah, you thought you could trap Mimeo. Hell no, dude. Okay, I gotta remember this number. Nine, seven. Okay, we're remembering nine, seven. Okay, this looks like it could be a trap base, but we're gonna open it up. Oh no, this is the jail. Oh no, I don't want to be back here, Jigsaw, no. Okay, let me turn the lights on. There we go, I can put my torch out. Oh man, look at this. Okay, I'm looking for clues. Nothing in the campfire, nothing under that chair. Everything could be a clue here. All right, that's locked. What's down here? We have a code lock and we have another number in there. Five, three, hang on, hang on. Nine, seven, five, three. Oh, 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 I am too smart for this. All right, what is in here? We have a healing tea and an oxygen tank. Okay, I think that's it. Okay. All right, we have another button here that says start. I guess we, we go ahead and press this. Okay, this is open. We have a cassette in here. Dear old friend. Okay, I don't really want to press any buttons. I don't know if I should. Let's listen to this cassette first. Do you remember this room? A friend of yours was trapped in here and tragically passed away. Don't. Oh, Did you behind step? you, James. Bro, hurry up, there's a timer, there's five oh. minutes, go. Bro! <laughs> Let's now see if you suffer the same fate. I won't. Pressing the button start a one minute timer. Can you escape before the time runs out? <laughs> oh God, okay. I have one minute to complete this puzzle or I die. Oh my God. <sighs> I'm actually kind of nervous. Okay, I'm gonna press this button and then we have 60 seconds. Let's do it, go. Done. Okay, time is counting. Bang. Uh, puzzle one. 9753. 9753. Oh, wait. I can open the hatch. Oh, I can't. 9753. Do I enter that there? No. Oh, God. I. Oh, no. Uh oh, it didn't shoot me. Oh, my God. Was it a bait? Did I just get baited? My heart was pounding and I thought I was dead. I don't think I was meant to actually beat that. But I can climb on this turret. Ah, uh, okay. I see what you did there, you little dog. You made me think I was going to die, didn't ya? <laughs> so this key is going to open most likely this door here, right? Let's go for it. Okay, we have a shop. Oh, I can buy a boonie. Hey, I'll buy that. Perfect. Got my hat. Frankenstein legs. Uh, sure. I don't know what we're going to need those for, but I'll take them. Oh, okay. The door opened. There we go. All right, let's keep going. Oh my God. This already looks harder. Dude, how many rooms are here? Holy moly. Okay, I'm going to go to the first one. All right, we have an elevator. Is this going to, is this going to take me up somewhere? Okay. We have a very creepy jigsaw picture. It's green. I remember that. Okay, top floor. We have a bunch of pressure plates. Oh, God. We have a reset button. We have another door here. Okay, we have another cassette for this puzzle. Let's go ahead and take a listen. On the floor in front of you, there are many pressure pads. I see that. Stepping on the wrong one will close the door to the button. But it will also start a four-minute timer. 
Fail to find the hidden path in time, and you will suffer a horrific fate. Good luck. How am I meant to know the path? Okay, the light is green. I guess we just try one and see if it works. No? Okay, let me reset. Let me reset. Okay, oh my god, the timer started though. This one? No? Okay. Process of elimination, dude. I got four minutes. Okay, this one first. Okay, it's these first two. And then I'm going to assume it's left. Yep, got it. And then forwards. No, okay, forget it, forget it. Reset. Oh my god, I've already done a minute. Okay, first two, left, left again, then forwards. Yep, I'm gonna go forwards again. No, okay, I knew that was a dumb idea. Come on, I gotta hurry. This one, this one, this one, this one. We're gonna go right. Damn it, it's not right. Dude, I'm struggling to remember the path. I guess that's the point. Okay, left, left. Forwards has to be left. Forwards? Yes. Okay. I'm going to go right. Has to be right. Has to be right. It's not right. Come on, man. I'm running against the clock here. I'm not dying. Bang. Left. Got to be forwards. It's got to be around that because I know that one's bad. This is it. This has to be it. Done. We did it. Press the button. All right. I think we did it. The timer stopped. I think we're okay. I also heard a door open down there. I wonder if I go back down, is the door going to be open? Oh, dude, the next door opened. Okay, I see what you're doing to me. Oh, God, what's next? I see this thing. We're probably going to get electrocuted. Um, We have a button and we have a box. Oh, we have a gun. Oh, hell yeah. Yo, can I shoot myself? This is called stress test. I don't like the sound of this, man. All right, let's give it a listen. When your life is on the line, are you nervous or stressed? Let's find out. Pressing the button starts a two minute timer. Get 10 points within the time and you will live. You get a point for each target you successfully down. Fail to get 10 points and I will give you something shocking. So I gotta take out 10 targets before the timer runs out or I get electrocuted. This is torture. You guys know I can't aim in this game. How am I gonna beat this? Okay, you know what? Here we go, done. Come on, give me a target. Oh my god, I gotta hurry. Come on, come on, come on. I gotta reload. Come on, man, I've only got two targets. I've only got one, apparently. No, what? Wait, how long did I have? Oh god, come on. <gasps> Shit, I'm so bad. Open, 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 open. Come on, we have three, dude. We have three. I don't remember how long I had. That's five. <gasps> I was reloading. Give me some targets. I need four more. Four more. Come on. I can do that. Nine. One more. Oh my God. Surely that's it. I think we did it. I think we did it. Easy. And you know what? I'm keeping the gun too. All right. Screw you. Oh my God. Okay. That was actually stressful. I hated that. Dude, we were so close to dying. I made it out of that room by the hair on my nuts. Well, I mean, there's no hair on my nuts, actually. This video is sponsored by Manscaped. Fellas, it is a new year and it's time for a new you. You need to be looking and feeling fresh, okay? Not just upstairs, all right? You got to work on downstairs too. Luckily, Manscaped is here to help. They have all the tools and formulations designed specifically for men, right? That's me. I'm a man. I'm a boy. This this is their performance package 4.0. This thing is a head to toe men's grooming kit. As you can see, there is a ton of stuff inside the box here. We have the Lawnmower 4.0 trimmer. Not only is the Lawnmower great for beard maintenance, but it's specifically designed with advanced skin safe technology, which helps reduce any nicks or cuts that you may get in your more sensitive areas. The trimmer is cordless and waterproof, and it even has a neat travel lock feature. Just tap the button on the front three times and it's going to lock the device that way you can just chuck it in a bag and it's not going to start buzzing on you it also comes with this really cool wireless charging dock and these led lights on the front let you know how much battery you have left you get up to 90 minutes with a full charge. Also in the box, we have two products that I never knew I needed until now. The Crop Preserver Ball Deodorant and the Crop Reviver Ball Toner Spray. So you apply the Crop Preserver after you shower so you can smell fresh all day long. 
Mm. And you can get a quick refresh with a spritz from the Crop Reviver. It has cooling aloe vera in it and it just smells so good. The Performance Package 4.0 also comes with their Weed Whacker Nose and Ear Hair Trimmer. It has 360 degree rotary blades and the same skin safe technology as the body trimmer. So you don't have to worry about any tugging or tearing, none of that. So if you guys are interested, you can enroll in their Peak Hygiene Plan. You get ongoing replenishments of your favorite products straight to your door. And for a limited time, if you buy the Performance Package 4.0, you get two free gifts. You get the Shed Travel Bag and the Manscaped Anti-Chafing Boxer Briefs. I literally wear these like every day. That's not a joke. Start your new year off right and head to manscaped.com and get 20% off with free international shipping. Plus, you get the two free gifts when you use code MIMIO20 at the checkout. And a big thank you to Manscaped for sponsoring this video. I'm going to go uh, trim myself. All right, I'm using a med stick while we go up here. Room number three, what do you have for me? We have a bunch of switches on the wall. We have, sounds like flame turrets waiting behind this door and a button. Okay, another cassette. Tell me what to do. Welcome to the human furnace. There are three combinations hidden in the switches. A combination can only consist of two switches. When a combination is found, one lamp will turn green. Get all the lamps green and you will be set free. Fail to find all combinations in 60 seconds and you will die. We need to light up these three lights by entering the right combinations. And a combination can only be two switches at a time. Okay. I don't even know how long we have. Did he even say? Oh, God. Um, okay. All right. Go for it. Okay. Uh, bang. One, two. <gasps> We've got it. Oh, my God. That's the first one. Okay. Uh, these two. No. All right, let's do process of elimination. This one and this one. No. I'm going through all of them. I feel like this is the smartest way. I got it. I got another. Let's go. Oh, my God. I don't know how long I have. I really hope it's not one minute. Oh, my God. We already did it. Oh, let's go. Yo, 200 IQ. Holy shit. Oh, my God. My palms are sweaty. Okay, I'm going to get out of this room before that door opens. Get me out of here. Room officially complete. On to room number four. Room number four. Okay. Oh my god, what is happening in here? We have a big room in there. We have a garage door. All right, where's the cassette? It's called Blind and Lost. Oh my god, okay. If that doesn't describe me in two words. Let's test your navigation skills. You can see the lights at the end of the room. Press the button below to survive. It may seem easy now, but things are not always as they seem. Do you still have that flashlight? No, I don't have the flashlight. It made me trade it. Are you kidding me? Is there anything in this trade? Oh no, what am I gonna do? Wait, wouldn't I be able to use this gun to make a... Does that make any light at all? Oh man, okay, so it's a grid and I'm assuming the doors are gonna close. All right, we're just gonna go for it. The blind leading the blind, let's go. Okay, it's open. Aha, I can use my gun. We're going right. Dude, I'm so smart. This is probably what you meant to do, but still. How much ammo do I have? Okay, I got plenty. Okay, we keep going this way. Okay, we're turning a corner. Oh my god, this is so dark. This is rust at night time. I gotta make sure I don't get turned around. Wait, I don't have any ammo. What happened to all my ammo? Did you take my ammo, you son of a bitch? Oh god, I can't see. Right, I'm just gonna keep walking this way. This way. Oh my god, I made it anyway. Oh my god. Yo, I think that guy took my ammo. We're gonna press the button. We did it. Wait, I think I was cheating. I don't think you're even meant to use the gun. <laughs> we did it anyway. Screw you, Jigsaw. Okay, I think we're halfway through. Oh my god, we still have so many to go. Room number five. We have some more ladders we're going up. And we have a box. I'm looking everywhere for clues. All right, we have a button. We have a cassette tape. Spider-Man. Oh, come on. I'm not doing parkour. This puzzle is one of the easier ones. No obstacles. You just need to press the button. That's it. I just need to press the button. How am I possibly going to get up there? I can't reach it. No, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me, Jigsaw. Hang on, hang on. Don't you get a boost going up a ladder? Is this right? Am I missing something? Oh, wait. Don't you need to be, like, falling off the box? Hang on, it's something like that. Oh, wait, I jumped higher then. Okay, wait, if I'm slightly off the box. Hang on, what's that rust command to jump higher? Physics.steps. Let's go like 100. Oh, hang on, that's a bit higher. Oh, come on, this is difficult. I'm glad there's no timer. One hour later. What was this thing called? Spider-Man. 
What does that mean? Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Can I swing up the wall? Can I climb up? Oh my God, I can climb up the wall. Dude, I spent so long jumping on that freaking box. I have... Man, I'm actually Spider-Man. I can climb up this wall. Oh my God, that is such a bait. I needed to look at the name of the cassette properly. God damn it. That took way longer than it ever should have. God damn it, that stupid box. Room number six. Okay, we got to do better on this one. Come on. But you know what? We're getting through them. We're actually doing pretty well. Wait a minute. This room looks familiar. I've seen this room before. We have a cassette. Hide and seek. There are four hidden triggers in this room find them and i will let you out if you cannot find them in time you will die okay so we have to activate four hidden triggers in this room and we're not even gonna know if we've activated them or not great all right first things first i'm doing all the uh, all the chairs okay mount that chair mount this chair sitting in one of these chairs has to be a trigger right all right there we go there we go we've got the piano next play the piano Okay, enough mucking around. We have furnaces. Oh, there's a key. Why is there a key in it? And there's pumpkin seeds. Okay, we'll take those out. We have four boxes. We have a large box here. We have a research table. Wait, can I put pumpkin seeds in the fridge? Dude, I bet that's a trigger. I bet that's a freaking trigger, dude. We have a sleeping bag. I'm renaming it. Screw you, Jigsaw. There could be something hidden. Oh, I heard a trigger. I actually heard a trigger. Something's definitely activated up there when I jumped up there. Oh, wait. Dude, I freaking see something behind it. Okay, I gotta put something in this box, right? Uh, have some seeds. Okay, that's gotta be one. That's gotta be two. <laughs> he renamed the bed. Screw you too. What the hell? Okay, okay. Let me think. On top of the furnaces? <gasps> I hear it. I hear it. That's another one. Okay, where haven't I checked? The middle of the room. Middle of the room. We have on top of the bed. Oh, it was that box. That was the last one. I didn't put anything in this. Okay, that actually took a while, but I got it. Okay, job done. Oh God, what is in here? What? I see a Frankenstein guy. Wait, I have Frankenstein legs on me. What does this do? Oh, I did not mean to do that. Okay, so I should be able to put his legs on and then bring him to life. There's a cassette in here. It's called Execution, Subject 1. Who are you, Subject 1? Stimpy, you've done too much bad to earn forgiveness. What? Now it will end. Stimpy. In five seconds, electricity will go through your body. May you never see the light of day again. Please, please don't. All I did was don't smack to some kid. Goodbye. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo, rip. Uh, F in the chat, boys. Okay, wait. Can I bring him back to life? Oh no, I'm missing some head from Stimpy. Wouldn't be the first time. You know what? I'm taking the stuff with me. Thank you. I'm taking Stimpy's body parts. All right, room number seven. Dude, we're nearly there. Holy shit. Oh no, there's a Frankenstein table here. And his head. Best friends forever. Wait, am I going to bring him back? There's also a pressure plate here. All right, let's give it a listen. Stepping on the pressure plate opens the door. Behind the door is a shotgun trap. If only you had a friend that would take the blow for you. Make it through all the doors, and you may continue. So we gotta build our friend here. Stimpy, you're coming back from the dead to help me. Wake up. Oh, God. Oh. Okay, my little zombified Stimpy. Uh, I want you to follow me. Good boy. All right, stand in the doorway. Please protect me. Oh, okay. It worked. It worked. Next room, buddy. Come on. Okay, that might work. Oh, okay. I took some damage. I'm gonna use a med stick, son. God damn. Okay, we have another cassette tape. It's called Your Deepest Desire. What does that even mean? The button you need to press is very close, yet so far. Make it through this next obstacle, and I might be kind and let you out of here. Okay, so we need to press that button. My Deepest Desire. What does that even mean? Oh, no. Is that the parkour? God damn it. Oh, my God. This is actually giving me PTSD. All right. Let's get started jumping on these freaking things. Yep. I've already messed it up. Okay. Looks like there's something back here. There's a snowman. Hang on. Is that some sort of secret? Am I even meant to see that? Snowman, what are you doing here? I don't actually think this room is for anything. Why is there a snowman here? Do you know what? Screw you. Okay, I did it. I did it. Where do I jump to? Am I meant to jump over to that? Really? Oh, no. Okay, I got it. I got it. Come on, baby. Okay, there we go. There we go. Oh, made it. Made it. Okay, I'm getting sweaty now. I'm assuming I have to jump on that door over there, right? No, the freaking roof's in the way. 
Okay, I'm getting better at this first part. How am I meant to get on that door over there? I'm gonna have to like crouch jump over. <gasps> oh no, that was close. I think I'm gonna have to like strafe jump it. Oh, I did it. I actually did it. All right, button. That's a sick joke. Okay, it's not button number one, that's for sure. I should have known he was gonna pull something like that, man. All right, I have to try and strafe jump it again. Well, I made that. That was the lag's fault. You saw it. No, that was terrible. That was dog shit. I, dude, I made that. I made that game. I got it. I got it. Dude, do I even press number two? You know what? I'm going straight for button number three. Screw you. Ha ha ha. I'm not doing that again. Go. No. God freaking damn it. 75 years later. Right, I'm going to try and jump around it. I think that's the go. Done. Oh my God. That was actually kind of awesome. Okay, from memory with these, you need to crawl under very, very carefully. Because if you fall off, I'm going to have to restart, aren't I? Crawl back up, crawl back up. Ha 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 ha, I remember that. Dude, I'm a parkour god now. All right, oh, I got to get to this stupid ladder. Oh my god. Okay, that was a bit risky, but I did it. How am I meant to get in that window? Is that a... That's a joke, right? No! Oh my god, I hate parkour. All right. One eternity later. I'll try and jump up to the window. Come on. Oh my god, he gets it. Let's freaking go. Screw you, puzzle. Tell me I'm done with that shit. Oh my god. Oh no, I'm not. Is that a joke? I don't even know if I'm going to make it to that first beam. God, dude, I don't have enough meds to do all that again. I'm going to have to make it. Okay. We're going to have to time this right. Please, dude. I can't restart again. Go. Yes. Screw you. Freaking stupid parkour. Oh, I already know what I have to do here, son. You can't get me with this. Come on. I got this. I got this. I got this. There we go. Tell me that's it. Tell me there's no more parkour. That took so freaking long, dude. There's the button. Oh my god. Dude, I think that was the hardest one so far. That took so long. Three rooms left, and then we're finally out of this nightmare. All right, we have a painting. We have a bunch of switches. The vault. All right, let's take a listen. Find the four-digit number, in which the first digit is one-fourth of the last digit. The second digit is six times the first digit. And the third digit is the second digit plus three. Press the button next to the door when you think you have a correct number. The drawing board can be used if needed. Right, you know what? Screw that. I'm not even going to use the whiteboard. I think I can do this in my head. Okay, so the first number is one fourth of the last number. The second number is six times the first number. And the third number is the second digit plus three. Okay, let's do some maths here. All right, let's keep number one. Let's keep that one. So that means this has to be four. Because that's one fourth of this, right? The second is six times the first. So that makes this six. And the third number is this plus three, which would be nine. So one, six, nine, four. That's, that's my first guess. One, six, nine, four. Let's go, baby. I literally got that first try. Am I a mathematician? Okay, we're on to the second last room now. All right, things are going to be getting difficult here. Oh my God, what am I even looking at? Look at this room. There's so much. Okay, this cassette tape is called Rooms Can Hide Secrets. All right. The only thing you need to do is purchase some low-grade fuel from the vending machine, but you need crude oil to do so. Lucky for you, I've hidden some in this room. Good luck finding it. So all we have to do is purchase the low grade for one diesel fuel and the diesel fuel is hidden in this room okay i already know it's not going to be in any of these but i'm going to check them just in case okay as expected everything is completely empty we're gonna have to think outside the box here okay diesel fuel let me swap my clothes no okay that did nothing that did nothing okay i don't see anything is there anything on the roof okay there's got to be a hidden box in here or something wait a minute dude is there a freaking gap in between there i've watched too many william videos before in my life i know there's a gap in here dude there's totally a gap in the floor look there is definitely gonna be a box under here i already know it dude you think i'm so dumb don't you there's gotta be a gap there has to be a gap where there's a box somewhere it's gotta be here i see the gap dude i can see it dude i can't get it wait if there's a gap in the floor that means there's probably a gap in the roof right i think i see Oh my God, I got it, dude. It's in the roof. The whole time I was looking at the floor, it's in the roof. 
That is genius. The gap is in the roof and the floor. Let's go. The light is green. Let's go. <laughs> oh, I just broke my legs. Oh my God. Is this the last room? Are we actually through? Why does this look so difficult? Look at all these numbers. What the f laser beams? Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Pressing the button starts the puzzle. All you need is a four digit code. Good luck, but be careful of lasers. Is that it? What does that mean? I need a four digit code. Watch out for lasers. I guess we, I guess we start. Oh, he means those lasers. Oh God, I can't leave the room. Four digit code, four digit code. Um, is there any clues in here at all? What do you mean a four digit number? I can't leave. Wait, 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 wait. There was a freaking, there was a four digit number at the start, wasn't there? On that camera, there was a four digit number. Oh, what was it? It started with nine, nine, seven, five, zero. Some, it was like nine, seven, five. Oh no, I can't remember. I can't even go back and check because there's freaking lasers. Nine, seven, five, zero. No, what was it? 9752. Oh my god, I can't remember it. 9753. Right, let me think. Do these Christmas lights have anything to do with it? Wait a minute. How many blue lights is there? 1, 2, 5, 6, 7, 8. How many red? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And how many green lights? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 9, 1, 0, 7? Dude, if that's actually it, I am 5 head. What is this room called? Laser beams. Okay, how many laser beams is there? Dude, I can't count how many there is. I mean, do I risk walking through these lasers? You know, what? I'm chucking a cassette through. Okay, I did nothing. I mean, really, what's going to kill me in this room if I activate the laser? I don't hear any turrets. I'm going to do it. Okay. Oh, there's numbers. God damn it. This dude had me scared of the lasers and I was meant to walk through them the whole time. Wait, let's go from top to bottom. So it's eight six one and then fours at the bottom eight six one four lovely that's what i like baby eight six one four we did it oh my god did we actually complete every room yo can i drive out of here this is sick oh my god we actually did so good yo get me out of here bro uh, i need the low grade for this <laughs> i'm getting out of here boys Woo! oh Okay, I uh, I didn't get very far. It is very dark out here. I see a light at the end of the tunnel. Hang on. Oh my God, this is the longest hallway ever. It's so dark. Oh my God, have we done it? We've done it, right? I see water. Oh no, this is what I need the diving tank for. Somewhere in the building, there should be a diving tank. If you are lucky, you have already found it. I did. If not, good luck. You have a Christmas stocking. All right, you know what? I'm putting all my diving gear on. I think we're going to go for it, dude. There's nothing in the stocking. All right, time to go. I'm getting out of here, boys. I'm making my grand escape. Screw this place. I never want to come back here again. My brain hurts. Did we get it? Oh, no. I was meant to count how many stockings there was. One, two, three. God damn it. I thought it was over. Four, five, six, eight, nine, eleven. I think there's eleven stockings. I mean, let's try eleven. Am I out? Am I actually free? Oh my god, land. The last tape. Until next time. I did it! Hey! Dude, that is so satisfying. We actually made it all the way through. Every single room. Yo, screw this place. I'm getting out of here. See you later, Jigsaw. Screw you. Oh my god, we finally made it to land. The sun is coming up. Oh, get me out of this boat. We did it. We survived the entire thing. I actually can't believe we made it all the way through that. And we have one final cassette tape to listen to. Oh, man. Let's see what he has to say. You think this is the last you will see of me? Think again. See you next time. What does that mean? What, what does that mean? Oh, God. Get me out of here. Once again, a massive thank you to Mr. Digi for creating this entire map. Make sure you check out his server, Cast Away, three times. It's a solo duo trio quad server for players looking for a faster than normal Rust experience. It has non-playing active admins on the server, including myself, so you may even get admin trolled on there. And there's even some small escape room events on there that you can take part in and receive rewards if you complete it. All of the server details are down in the description. Make sure you join Castaway three times and tell Mr. Digi I said thanks in the chat. Uh, that's pretty much it. I've spent way too long on this video. Bye!
water, ayy. Sippin' gin, no tonic, ayy. Ain't no label, ain't no way. Sunday work, no Chick-fil-A. Buy six, tax from lithium.